Hi, Phil Aston here from Now Spinning Magazine, and I'm taking you back to 1978. And it's an album called Clark Kent. It's a double album, also released as a double CD. Here it is. And it's actually by Stuart Copeland. Yes, him from The Police. This came out, as I say, 1978, and that was the same year that the police really took off as a band. And so it was felt by the record label that this could distract from that success. And so it came out under a pseudonym, under another name, as Clark Kent. And musically, you can tell that Stuart was part of the police's overall sound. There are some tracks on here that Sting actually turned down, and so they became part of Clark Kent's pers personality, if you like. What's the music like? Well, it's very much like the police. There are lots of, there's some new wave, there's some punk stuff, there's a bit of buscocks in them places. But what might surprise you is the amount of almost like avant-garde prog there is. Now, these songs aren't long. Uh, the last song, Office Talk, is about six, six and a half minutes long, and the one before that is quite long-ish. But they're quite short, but they remind me in places of Frank Zappa. There are elements of Steve Hackett, his guitar playing in places, and also Hawkwind's Hawk Lords or um, Cork Strangers and Charm, that kind of period of stuff. But it's a and it's the instrumental stuff, because there, there are vocals, obviously, there are some short songs of vocals on, but primarily there's a lot of instrumental stuff on here. Uh, Gorilla's really good, Grand Delinquent is very good, old school, very punky, Kinetic Ritual is a very proggy avant-garde song as well. And Stuart plays everything on it. The bass, the guitar. In fact, on the, for, for those of you who would like to know this, the guitar he plays is a 1969 Gibson SG Standard. And everything was just plugged into his four-track studio. He used a drum box, um, which is interesting, being a drummer. Um, but obviously, he's recording this a lot in his flat. Um, and it sounds, it sounds fantastic. Obviously, he was using, he was using Fender Telecaster uh, bass as well. So there's some wonderful stuff in it. It's a, I know that this album has a lot of fans and it's been out of print for a long time. So this is a real chance to, to grab it. The two, the two vinyl set is really good. Um, you've got polyline sleeves, which is again, um, I have to say that BMG Records in 2023 have had a lot of polyline sleeves in their vinyl stuff and it's great to see. The two CD set also comes with a second disc of lots of demos so you can actually get a feel for how the songs came together as well. Um, there's 18 tracks on the on the main album um, so if you're a fan of The Police it's an essential part of that jigsaw and if you're into music from the late 70s the new wave and again a bit of avant-garde zapper kind of noodling with guitar and stuff then give this a listen it's available on all streaming platforms so you can actually give it a stream before you play or go further say there's a two cd set and a two vinyl version as well so thank you for watching thank you for being here please click subscribe and become a youtube member or a patron and help support now, mag now spinning magazine even further Take care, everybody. Keep spinning those discs, and I shall see you all very, very soon.